I wonder if I can find Arana's piece from this side. I know how to get to it from town. I'm not really sure the way from anywhere else. Gotcha! Lishy, Lishy, riddle's done. Thank you much for all the fun. <laughs> All right, thanks. You don't notice anything special? You say hello, but there's only silence in return. You say... Detect magic? This entire area is permeated with powerful magic. There are no bushes. What happens if I go back? Oh, there's a wyvern now. Blind him. And time for lightning. <laughs> it's Trogdor! Except he doesn't have legs and he's got two arms. isn't the way, is it? Nope, this is the cemetery. No more burninating. The peasants in their thatched roof cottages shall have to remain intact. That's not it. Go over. Man, don't want to fight any more of these guys. I'm low on stamina. All right, not sneak. Of course, I know a way to make him run away, but where's the fun in that? This is good practice. And flies back to the middle so he can die. How are we doing? Luck, magic, weapon use. Very low on stamina. Maybe that is the correct way. Yep, this was it. I was there all along. Your magical last. Does this tree do anything for us? After all the work it took you. Nope. Reminds me of when I'd play Street Fighter against someone who would only play as Ryu and only do Hadoukens. Hey, some people some... don't know the other moves. Yeah. After some rest. Yep, yeah, we definitely do feel better. Time? Let's after some rest one more time. After some. And now. It's probably almost night. Yep, almost there. Because there's still one more wraith left. Hmm. 
Nope, that's Baba Yaga's house. But we do know where to find the wraith from here. And we just need to follow the wall. Although I think the wraith only shows up whenever it's actually dark. Alright, now what? Rabbit? No problem. There. I thought there was still one more step between us, but no, he was actually in range. Okay. I think this is the place where the other wraith spawns. So we will just crash here until night. After some. After. There we go. We're still hurting a little bit. Hello, staff. We'll just leave that for now. Uh, <laughs> I walked it. I walked behind the staff as I was. Where exactly where was it? You feel it. So we'll go ahead and you cast. There's our aura. And let's see. We also need reversal, but I don't think it helped that much. Boy, this is going very poorly. All right, get close. Wraith vanishes. It was a lot better just to go in and engage him because the barrow you find a hoard of 150 gold crowns that should improve your cash flow getting paid but it was better to go in and fight him in the actual your battle scene has... just because i could charge my spells and they would just envelop and overpower his I'm gonna go ahead and. No, wait, that's the poison ones. This one. That feels good. Just what you needed to relieve some of the aches and pains of everyday adventuring. And also, we're gonna. Ha Om nom some you fruit. Feel a that ought to cover us until we get back to town. Your reverse. And there are no more wraiths, so it should be safer to walk around at night. It's still very dangerous, but it's safer. Current time, plenty. And there she is. Hello again. Did you get my note? 
I hoped I could see and, and speak with you again. I hope you don't think I am too uh, forward. It's just that I don't meet many new people around here. I love to hear about your adventures. Oh, oh, you've been hurt. Are you sure you should be out wandering? You really need to take care of yourself more. Oh, thanks. Here, let me see if I can make you feel better. I have a potion of healing right here. I hope it will help you. She's spitting into the mic. I think she might be. So, hi, Katrina. It is nice to see you again. There are not a lot of heroes around here, you know. We've been busy. You tell Katrina more about yourself. She seems to be hanging on every word. Oh, you have seen so many places and people. I love listening to your adventures. I think some of it might also just be the compression. Magic is very... Nope. My name is... Kat I mostly just work in the castle. That's why I can't see you during the day. Someone might notice I'm gone. We've been to the castle during the day. No one is allowed in the castle unless he is invited. Maybe sometime you will get an invitation? I hope so. I really want to get to know you better. Want to go on a date? I, I must go. Maybe, maybe we can meet again? It's too dangerous for me to come here again. It's so far from the castle. Maybe, maybe we could meet by the castle gate some evening. I'll watch for you there. Please, don't mention me to the gatekeeper. I'll get in trouble if anyone finds out I sneak out of the castle. They, they think it's too dangerous outside the gate. But I need to get out to, to see you again. Goodbye. You watch her walk off before you think of doing anything else. Was it something I said? Can we climb it? You're getting some good practice in climbing. You'll need to keep practicing before you'll be able to make it over this wall. It was built to keep monsters out of the town. Tell you what, let's um, float up and over. Whoop. Yeah. And you cast the ritual of release. Can we take it now? The staff feels warm and almost a This I must first do. The sacrifice of life for one of love. You find yourself letting go of the staff very quickly. Okay, so we have to figure that out first before we can take the staff. You're getting some good. Just burn all our stamina right here. Yep, 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 you'll get. Yep, 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 yep. You're getting. Yep. Climbing is 124. You hear me? Someone became a vampire for the one they loved? Well, we don't know that yet. Maybe the Dumbavoy can tell us a little something. You get a fine meal of roast lamb garnished with red cabbage. Oh, and uh, liberally flavored with garlic. <laughs> Let's talk about ourselves to just nobody in particular. Oh, you've done quite a lot in Mordavia, pal. Yeah, it's a good thing you came here, a good thing. Yeah, because frankly, we never knew there were that many things to do around here. <laughs> Uh, nothing new there. Nothing new there.
Oh, let's just ask about all this stuff. Tell me about the cave. Cave? What am I, a tour guide? What cave? Oh, you must mean my apartment. We know of no cave in Mordavia. He probably means the cave of the Dark One. Oh, yeah. That cave. <laughs> Very scary, you know? We didn't know you meant that cave. We, uh, generally don't care to talk about it. It's, uh, somewhat on the cursed side, know what I mean? Oh, yeah. It's bad luck. Very bad. It was made by the cult when they performed their unspeakable rites there. And a few unspeakable wrongs from what we hear. That's why it's kinda Ixnay on the Ave K, you follow? These guys need their own spin-off game. Do you remember years ago that there was a um It was like Poker Night thing with a whole bunch of characters from different franchises all gathered together. These three should have been in there. There was like, uh, what, Strong Bad? Um. What was his name from Venture Brothers? Brock? No, not Brock. Dang, I'm forgetting all kinds of things tonight. I remember Strong Bad was in it. Just having these three guys in something like that, just to have them talking more, would have been great. So, how are you guys doing? Well, now that the harvesting season's over, I can relax a skosh. Oh yeah, now that the garlic is gathered and the cloves are put into the ground for next year, I can sit, enjoy myself, and be stinky. <laughs> now that the elephants are all gone, I have nothing better to do than sit here and help the others drink. I regard it as kind of a public service. Yeah, I can't even remember the full title of it. It's just, it's something that I remember existing, never had, never played. I watched some videos about it. It just seemed like the the character interactions. Poker Night at the Inventory. That's it. Thank you, BP. I think there were two of those games. Hey, you guys know about a Rasalka? A Rasalka is the undead spirit of a drowned maiden, okay? Yeah, she tries to lure others to a watery death. What a body! <laughs> That's the downside. The upside is she doesn't wear any clothes. So obviously there is some attraction, but there was a rumor for a while that there was a Rasalka in Mordavia's lake. Yeah, no one who tried to check this rumor out ever returned. Rusalka's supposed to be very beautiful, you know. And the ones that went to find out were all guys. What a pity. What a shame! Yeah, but what a way to go. <laughs> what a shame, what a way to go. Vampires? Oh, great. Chamber of Commerce is gonna have a fit. Look, just because Mordavi is noted for vampires, it doesn't mean that there are any here. Yeah, just because we string garlic everywhere doesn't mean we're worried about vampires, it just means we're stinky! Yeah, I mean, come on, you're you're overreacting here. Just because no one dares to go out at night or even thinks about visiting Castle Borgov doesn't mean we believe in vampires here. <laughs> Alright, tell me about the castle that doesn't have vampires. Look, we know doodly squat about the people of the castle, alright? Oh, he's right. I mean, we have no reason to suspect that they're vampires. Other than the fact that no one has seen them in the daytime, and huge black bats circle the castle at night. No reason at all. I'm convinced. Look, Cool Breeze, I tried to tell you before, we do not gossip here. Yeah, unless we really want to. 
And if there's any backstabbing going on around here, pal, we're gonna do it face to face. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can sleep or chill out in our room until the dumb voice shows up again. You unlock the door to your room and go in. Just for an hour. After some rest. Actually, we know whenever it's time because it'll tell us that we're super tired because we've been doing this every single night, not getting enough sleep. After some rest, you feel better. After some rest, you're getting tired. There we go. Need to head out? All right. Thanks for swinging by, Tizen. We're probably going to be wrapping up pretty quickly here. There's the Domovoy. You see that the Domovoy is here again. So I think after we talk with this guy, then we're going to call it. So, hello, Dumbavoy. Oh, good, good. Very, very good. You go bad place, you come back. Oh, very good. Now, uh, which bad place are you talking about? Oh, you did good. Dumbavoy very happy not to be in very bad place. Dumbavoy very happy not to be dried up. Oh. He was talking about the monastery. Yeah, that was a while ago. Oh, happy am I. You help me. You, I help. I help you help others. You be plenty big hero here. Many, many hero things to do, hmm? Bad place, Domovoy, all better now. Bad place Domovoy now live in Burgomeister's place. Maybe good luck to Burgomeister. You help me, then I help you. You want to be big hero? You want to make many people happy? You want to make friends and influence people? First, to be plenty good hero, need to be very, very powerful. If not very skilled, you die. If not very smart, you die. Oh, no more hero. Domovoy tells story. Yuri and Bela have daughter Tanya. Lovely daughter. Laughing daughter. One day, Tanya taken away. All because of doll. I'll tell me about Tanya. Tanya, sweet, sweet child. Tanya like everyone. Then Bela have dream. Dream Tanya taken away. Bela very scared. Not let Tanya play outside. Not let Tanya have friends. Tanya get scared of dark. Tanya many times alone at back of inn in dark. One day, monster come. Big, big monster. A friendly monster. He visit Tanya's window. He talk to Tanya. Tanya not afraid of dark. Tanya now have monster friend. One night, Tanya very, very unhappy. So monster take Tanya away. Monster want to make Tanya happy. Now Tanya gone. Tanya gone to castle. No one see Tanya leave. No one see Tanya go. No one but Domovoy. Domovoy tried to stop Tanya, but too late, too late. Tanya already outside with monster. No tell Bela. No tell Yuri. Very bad thing. Tanya need hero. Ha, not dead parents. Only brave, powerful hero save Tanya. So, what's this about a doll? 
One night, Tonya get beautiful doll. Tonya not have doll before. Tonya love doll very, very much. Bela very, very scared. Where doll come from? Yuri very, very scared. Who gave doll to Tonya? Take doll away. Make Tonya very, very sad. Bela hide doll in cabinet. You take doll. Tanya love doll. Maybe you help Tanya, hmm? No talk Bela. No show Bela doll. Make Bela very scared. Make Bela very unhappy. You take doll. You take doll to Tanya someday, hmm? Someday you very powerful hero. You take doll to Tanya. Okay. Well. We now have a doll. You open the cabinet and see a lovely doll. You carefully remove the elegant doll from the cabinet and store it in your pack. You look very cute holding the doll close to your chest. <laughs> yes, very cute. But not the least bit heroic. Take doll. Become plenty powerful hero. Then Tanya you help. Well then. Seems like we've got something we can do tomorrow. And by tomorrow I mean Sunday. Because we're going to head back up to our room. We're going to go to locked. sleep. And that's where we are going to wrap up for tonight. So, thank you all for joining me. We will pick this back up on Sunday. BP, thank you for the resub. Everyone else, well, thanks for just hanging out with me. I'm enjoying this ride, and I hope you all are too.